And there's the Arduino inductance meter uh, reading the inductance of this same coil uh, that we measured at 99.9 .9 microhenries using the oscilloscope method and 102 microhenries using the commercial pros kit meter. The Arduino reads it as 98 microhenries and it's putting it in series with a 2 microfarad capacitance which is why the ringing frequency here is uh, lower than it was before. Okay, and uh, stand by for a moment while I readjust and reset and I will show the scope traces that are associated with the frequency determination method um, and inductance method that the Arduino meter uses. Good morning, welcome to my laboratory. Uh, what you're looking at now is this the same uh, ordinary monofiler pancake coil there hooked up to the Arduino inductance meter and I just wanted to show the the, the, uh, the way that the Arduino is actually measuring the inductance of this meter. The Arduino gives me 98 microhenries for this uh, or rather for this coil. For this coil I get 98 microhenries and I got 99.9 uh, .9 and 102 using the other methods that, uh, that I've measured. So here's what the scope display looks like. I have um, the top trace is the response from the comparator in the, Ar in the uh, Arduino front end circuitry that is used to actually sense the response of the inductor. This is the output pulse and then the inductor's ringing and then this is the comparator's response uh, counting each of the peaks. Let me get that at a little bit better resolution so you can see what's going on there. I'll delay it and move it over a little bit. Okay, so focus. Okay, so there's the input stimulation and then there is the ring down and then there is the comparator's response to the ringing there. Okay, and here's the circuit and I'll put the code for the Arduino sketch in the description to the video. Now for this for the purposes of this video I have all of the reporting and LCD operating functions disabled in the sketch so that the um, so that the system will go ahead and do its thing fast enough to be displayed on the screen with a nice set of oscilloscope traces. Okay, so you get an input pulse and then the inductor ringing and then the comparator counts all of the peaks and then the Arduino finds the frequency of those uh, count peaks from the comparator and then does some math to determine the um, inductance of the inductor under test based on the units two microfarads of known capacitance. All right, thanks for watching.